Today's topic is the evidence of hope. In the book of 1 John chapter 3, verse 1 through 3, the apostle set forth practical teaching on the love of God and Christian living and conduct. And he says, Behold, what manner of love the Father hath bestowed upon us, that we should be called the sons of God. Therefore the world knoweth us not, because it knew him not. Beloved, now are we the sons of God, and it doth not yet appear what we shall be, but we know that when he shall appear, we shall be like him, for we shall see him as he is. And every man that hath this hope in him purifieth himself, even as he is pure. Evidence is defined as that which tends to prove or disprove something. Hope is defined as a confident expectation. The hope John describes includes three primary factors. That is, Christ's appearing, the believer seeing him, and the believer becoming as he is. Hallelujah. And the foundation for our hope now and forever is Christ alone. And I want to emphasize the fact that the evidence of hope or the proof of hope is therefore that of self-purification. That is, people making choices to not engage in certain things. And it does not mean you can't do a thing, but rather because of the hope that you have, you choose not to do it. This type of decision making proves that true hope is in us. This hope drives us like it did the Apostle Paul when he declared in Philippians 3, 13 through 14, Brethren, I count not myself to have apprehended, but this one thing I do, forgetting those things which are behind me and reaching forth unto those things which are before him. God bless you today. Make sure your life displays the evidence of the hope you have in looking like Jesus. God bless you.